hello guys welcome back to the video player app series in this part we are going to design our folder view means we will show the folder list into our folder fragment so first i am going to create a layout resource file and where we will create a folder item to show into the folder fragment and it will be having a root element of relative layout so press ok now and here i'm going to split it into the code editor so we have to click on it and now after this we will have to design our folder item so here we will write some codes to design this folder item with the help of an image view and a text view to show that image view as folder and text view for the file folder name so here we will create an image view so write image view and it will be having a width of let's say 50 dp and also the height will be also 50 dp and now i'm going to give it an id so let's give it an id of folder image and now i'm going to give it a source image Oops. and before that i'm going to change this width and height of 60 dp and then here we will add a source attribute for the folder image and we have already added this vector asset into our driver folder so just double tap on it and now you can see the image view folder image view so now i'm going to change its color to some thing like this just choose this color and now this is looking good so now we can close this image view by adding a padding the padding looks weird so just delete this and uh, give it a margin start of 10 dp and now the then close the image view and now i'm going to add a text view for the folder name so just adding the width and height of wrap content and i'm going to give it an id so folder name as an id and also i'm going to give a text so that i can see what is going on in this design so added a text to start of folder image no this should be to end of the folder image id now the fol folder name is visible so now i'm going to give a text color to has 000 for black and uh, after this margin start of let's say 10 dps as you can see in the layout resource now this is center vertical by adding a center vertical to true so we have designed this folder item now we can use it in our folder adapter that we will create a java class so just go to the java folder and here go to the package name and just right click on it a new java class for our folder adapter our custom folder adapter where we will use for the recycler view so here we have to write extends which will extend adapter recycler view dot adapter and it will take parameter folder adapter the name that you have given to the java class adapter and dot my holder and press alt enter to create this class my holder and it will extend the default view holder and press alt enter to add this super item view it will have to be static to resolve this warning and now here we will have to create three instance variable one is of type string folder name and the other will be private or a list or a list of video files and uh, let's say name it as video files and the third one will be pri private context the context that we have to pass from the folder fragment and uh, now press alt insert and here we have to create a constructor that will be having a, a three argument and this will be in a slide by the arguments that is passed in the folder adapter and now hover over it and press alt enter to add these three methods here 
and here it returns the number of folder items that we have to add into our folder fragment recycler view so here we have to re return folder name dot size and for that we have to create this as a list of string because we have to show a list of the folder names so a list of strings and also we have to change this folder names no leave it as folder name and then here in this argument we have to write a list of string and now the error is resolved so after this we can return here folder name dot size and now in this on create view holder we will create an instance of view layout inflator dot from m context dot inflate and here we will inflate the layout that we have created folder item so write folder item that we have just created and the second argument will be parent view group and the last one will be false attach to root false and now this will just return new my holder that we have created the class and it will take argument as view that we have just created so now we can initialize our image view no we don't have to initialize the image view and now just initialize the text view as a folder name so that we can change the folder names of each of the list items so folder name equals item view dot find view by id r dot id dot folder name that we have given the id to the text view into our folder item just press alt enter and remove this and here just close this and also we can close this close this and almost we have done this folder adapter and now i'm going to folder fragment and before that we have to go into our main activity and uh, here we will create an static array list of string that will hold the folders list equals new array list this will hold the folder names of all of the files so just go to the get all audio methods and here after this we have to write our logics of substring so that we can get the folder name so here we will have to first create an integer variable that will be of slash first index equals path dot last index of the character slash you can see now semicolon string slash it means we are going to storage means we are going to the path that looks like storage slash storage slash sd card let's say slash video directory slash abc the folder name slash my video file dot mp4 let's say and from this path we will get the index at this slash means the last index of the slash so we will get the this index and after this we will create a substring from that slash first index using path dot substring and here we will pass first argument as 0 from start index and the last argument will be slash first index this will not count the slash first index means the last index of the this so we will get only this string substring and after this uh, we will get this as you can see as we have commented this in substring variable because the last index of the last index will be excluded so slash is excluded from the sub uh, path 
and it will be stored into the substring string and now we will create another integer variable that will let's say index and here we will get the last index of substring from the string again pass the slash so we will get this index and now we can get again the substring as a folder name so string folder name equals substring that we have already got dot uh, substring from the index position plus one index position plus one and comma the last index that is slash first index and it will get it will give us this folder name abc so after doing this we will get a folder name as abc and it will be looping for each of the files so we will get all the folder name where all the files are stored so these were why the tricks that we have used by using the substring methods and uh, we will check if folder list dot contains the folder name means we are checking if it is not contained then we will add that folder name into our folder list so add folder name which is of type string so now we have added all the folder names into our folder list and we will use it into our folder fragment where we will pass into our folder adapter so we will be showing into it so write it as just folder name folder adapter here create instance of folder adapter and then i am going to check into a folder fragment that the recycler view i have added already so now i am going to create an instance of recycler view also and here in on create view just cut this and this will be view equals instance of view equals the paste the code that we have just cut and here we will return this view we have just created this view to initialize the recycler view view dot find view by id or dot r dot id dot this id folder rv so now we will check if folder adapt folder list from the main activity just import this by alt enter now enter if it is not equal to null and also folder list dot size is greater than zero then we will initialize our folder adapter here so folder adapter equals new folder adapter where we will pass all the arguments that we have created so folder name here we have to pass the folder list so just write folder list and the next argument will be the video files that we have to import from the main activity and the last one will be get context means the context and to avoid the null pointer exception i am going to check another condition and video files is not equal to null now this will not throw any null pointer exception so we can now pass this folder adapter into our recycler view as a set adapter method so just pass this folder adapter and after doing this we have to set layout manager so recycler view dot set layout manager new linear layout manager the first argument will be context and the second one will be the orientation that is vertical and the third will be reverse layout to false and now just go to the folder adapter here and in on bind view holder we have to set the text for each of the folder names so just write folder name dot set text here we are not seeing any of the methods why it is so just change this name maybe this is because of ambiguity that we have created a text view as folder name and also the array list of string as folder name so just write now folder no we are not seeing it 
okay we are doing this in wrong way actually we have to write here holder dot folder first we have to write the instance of the view holder that is holder and then yeah holder dot folder dot set text now here we have to pass folder name the array list of string and get position and this will get all the folder names from the folder list array list so now this is done so we have done everything for showing the folder names into the folder list means the folder fragment so now i'm running the app and we will see if the folder names into the folder fragment is showing or not so wait for the installation and now here you can see the folder list is visible now all the folders that i have is showing here but it is the color black so we have to change this to white also and also some thing we have to increase the size of the relative layout that means the height of the folder items so just go to this folder item and here we have to just change this first width to 80 dp and also height to 80 dp to increase the height and also we have to change this to hash ff means we are going to change this to white color because we are having a background of almost black so now you can see it is looking good now yeah you can see this so that's it for the tutorial thank you for watching in the next part we will cover the video files showing according